You are now basic cadets. Welcome to the Air Force Academy. Welcome to a year in the blue. You will not speak unless spoken to. Whenever I A Year in the Blue is a documentary about how the Air Force Academy takes cadets and transforms them into leaders of character. The film follows cadets of 10th Squadron through an entire year and documents the transformation of those who are just entering to those who are preparing to graduate in full detail. Get off my bus! Many of those who came before were at the 2012 Air Force Association Conference in Washington, D.C., including Lieutenant General Michael Gould, who graduated from the Academy in 1976. General Gould is the Academy's superintendent, and he introduced A Year in the Blue for its premiere at AFA. The real idea was to tell the story of your Air Force Academy and the things that go on throughout the course of a, a cadet's career. And the real story is about these young men and women who are stepping up, volunteering to serve our country in a time of war. David Emmerich was on hand for the premiere. He produced A Year in the Blue. He and his crew spent 135 days at the Academy shooting 300 hours of film. It's really quite a place and we had a great time telling the story and we were very proud of the film. One of the things I knew coming here was that I wasn't coming to the Academy for basic training. Basic training is six weeks out of four long years. So this actually is a college, it's not just basic training. Name is John Robinson, class of 1985. Robinson, who now works for Boeing in government operations, says a year in the blue definitely captured the experience of a cadet's first year. I got an opportunity to, in my own mind, relive some of those experiences and uh, in a very real and visceral way. And um, I think that will resonate to any graduate and to anybody who aspires to become a graduate. That was a very good representation of the experience that I had going back to 1985, my first year at the Academy. Very formidable years for all of us and uh, certainly for me and hit very close to home. My name is Alex Cole and I graduated the class of 1992. It takes a bunch of individuals and it breaks you down to bring you back as a team and, earn, and learn the value of being a team member. And it doesn't take away your complete individualism, but it shows you the power of being a team. General Gould hopes the up-close and personal feel of the documentary serves as a testament to what the Academy strives to do in developing new leaders. We're doing this with the intent, with the vision, of creating a sense of fanatical pride in the institution of the Air Force Academy. And it's a pride that, that we're not trying to develop by making it easier or more fun. It's pride rooted in excellence, and it's that excellence that's enhanced through common, shared, challenging experiences. That's our goal. 